In this video, we will show you how to use the Promira Serial Platform with the Control Center Serial Software to program an I2C EEPROM. The Promira Serial Platform is the latest development in total phases I2C and SPI tools. It can act as an SPI master and slave at up to 80 and 20 MHz respectively, and an I2C master and slave at up to 3.4 MHz. The application-based platform can easily expand in capability with software license upgrades. To get started, we will first download the Control Center Serial software directly from the Total Phase website. The software is free to use and compatible with Mac, Windows, and Linux operating systems. Once downloaded, we will open the software and connect the Promira Serial Platform to the application. To connect the Promira platform, we will plug the tool directly into our PC using a micro USB cable. Then go to the adapter menu and select connect. Choose the Promira platform and select OK. The transaction log now shows the Promira platform has successfully connected to the software. Next, we will connect the Promira platform to the I2C SPI activity board via the 10 pin header cable. This activity board has an I2C EEPROM, SPI EEPROM, and an I2C port expander to control these LEDs. For this demo, we will be programming the I2C EEPROM. First, we need to supply power to the EEPROM. To do this, simply click on the adapter tab at the top of the screen and select target power. Here, users can set the target power to either 3.3 or 5 volts. For this chip, we will enable 5 volts. Once enabled, we can see in the transaction log that power control has been enabled and we can confirm the EEPROM is receiving power by the LED indicator light on the activity board. Once powered on, we will enter the slave address into the I2C control window. The slave address for this device is 0 hex 50. First, let's read the existing contents of the I2C EEPROM by selecting Master Read. The device contents are displayed in the transaction log. Next, we will enter the data we wish to program into the message box. For this example, we will enter in 00112233. Keep in mind that the first byte, 00, is the offset where we will begin writing or reading. Once the data is entered, we will click on the Master Write button to write the data to the EEPROM. We can now see in the transaction log that the data we entered was written to the EEPROM, as symbolized by the W in the read-write column of the log. To verify that the data was written to the EEPROM, we can perform a master read function to read back the written data. First, we will write 00 to begin our read from the same offset. Then, we can click on the master read button to read from the offset. As you can see, as shown in the transaction log, the data 112233 was read from the EEPROM indicating that the master write was successful. As you can see, programming I2C and SPI chips is quick and easy with the Promira Serial Platform and Control Center Serial Software. For more information on these tools or other Total Phase solutions, please visit us online at www.totalphase.com.